cryptocurrencies or bitcoins or anything like that are not really currencies or are assets. They, a euro is a euro. Today, tomorrow, in a month, it's always a euro. And uh, the ECB is behind the euro. Uh, who's behind the cryptocurrencies? And so they are very, very risky assets, the value of which oscillates, as you've seen, wildly. They, at this point in time, they don't, uh, they are not significant enough in their entity that they could affect our, our economies in a macro way. Uh, and so we, we tend to consider them as speculative assets, highly risky, but as far as the rest is concerned, we are not, it's not really something that pertains to the central bank, the task of monitoring and regulating possibly this. It's more, what I would say, more something that falls within the consumer's protection uh, competence, where you want to make sure that people who buy into these assets know what they do and are aware of the risks they run.